Caleb, first one up because you're level five. Favorite string gauge for and brand for electric? Um, I prefer to use tens on my electric. Nines are also very, very handy. And when it comes to brand, I actually just don't care. So I'm pretty sure I just get whatever is the bulk cheapest one I can get. And I believe they're Didario's, Didario Electrics uh, strings. Um, a lot of people like comment, like a lot of people are like, use these strings, use these strings. And like strings definitely matter. I'm not going to lie to everyone when it comes to strings. Like they definitely do matter, but they matter a lot less than how good you play. So tone traditionally comes from your hands. I don't like it. It just is a, a thing. Like you hear John Mayer play like multiple different kinds of guitars. It sounds like John Mayer. You hear Slash play multiple different kinds of guitars. It sounds like Slash. Like when I play any guitar, it sounds like me playing the way I like to play. So I find that it's more about comfort for you. And um, so whatever kind of strings, you experiment with what you might like if you want to get serious about it. Um, but there's no one best string. So it's just whatever is like fits your needs. So for me, cheapest and easiest to get is my need currently. Um, and maybe if I'm like sponsored by Elixir or Dodario or someone like that in the future, uh, maybe I will just tell you guys that's the only strings you should buy because um, they're the best. But uh, like that is my total, uh, my... Uh, my unfiltered opinion about strings. Uh, if you if you think strings are holding you back, the only thing that holds you back on strings is tension. Um, so if you're like if your hands are sore when you're playing, get lighter gauge strings. If you feel like you are lacking thickness in your like sound, then that means you need heavier gauge strings. Uh, as long as condition one is not removed. So if you get heavier st- gauge strings and your and your hands get sore then go back to lighter gauge strings just remember that every time you alternate between string gauges it will affect the setup of your guitar so i would recommend if you do not know how to professionally set up your guitar get someone good to do it 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 is like the ultimate hack when it comes to guitars a lot of people think they need like five thousand dollar guitar no you just need a good setup and a good setup can cost like 50 bucks so Get a good setup, get strings that don't make you your hands sore, and then you win. Like the ultimate goal for anyone practicing and getting better at guitar is um, I always say the best guitar to get is the guitar that you don't want to put down. And the best strings to get are the strings that let your hands play the longest. Because the longer the guitar is in your hand uh, and the longer you can play the guitar, typically you get better. Um, where people quit is they get told to buy a certain thing, they buy that thing, and it doesn't work. Um, a concrete pill, as Tom has suggested in the chat, also helps. Spoons of cement will also make you effective. And in Australia, we have a thing called harden the up. I was going to say the bad word, but yeah, I dodged it. I'm getting better. All right. It's 40 a piece for cleanup and setup, and you can't beat it here. Perfect. There you go. Like I, I think about things like where does my time want to be spent? So if you are someone who loves like tinkering with things, you should totally learn how to set up. Like it's a totally cool thing. And in our online music school, the guy who sets up my guitar, he's already agreed to help me record a course. So I'm going to go take all my gear and I'm going to record him and he's going to explain how a beginner can approach setting up their guitars so it'll be really enlightening for me um as i'm not going to stop taking it to him because i don't have time to set up a guitar but uh i will get him to record a course for you guys and so if you can just be patient with me obviously i'm trying to tick all the boxes in the music school but uh we're going to get there and you will have the best string setup video possible as well as the uh, best possible advice on taking care of your guitar and that's what uh, I want to get to you guys done for free ASAP. Anyway, so there you go. Caleb, is that, a, is that a good answer for you? I hope it was a good and enlightening answer. Um, and I love it when you give me these random little questions. <laughs> they are so good. 